Today, I'll be showing you how to make a giant chocolate Easter egg. In a large mixing bowl, add the following. Three cups of cocoa powder, two tablespoons of butter, one third cup of white sugar, one third cup of maple syrup, three cups of full cream milk, one tablespoon of water, and finally, one cup of chocolate syrup. And finally, one cup of chocolate sauce. Turn on the mixer. Turn on the mix. Turn on the mix. Turn on the mix. Turn on the mix. No. Uh -oh. Looks like we accidentally spilled some of the mixture. To ensure that the quality of the chocolate isn't compromised, we're going to have to restart the recipe in a large mixing bowl. Add the foam. Cocoa powder, white sugar, brown sugar, icing sugar, raw sugar, dark brown sugar, 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 sugar maple syrup, butter, butter, butter. More eggs. Add more eggs. I said more eggs! Hurry up! by hand. Perfect! Now that we've finished making the chocolate, it's time to mold it into a giant Easter egg. To do this, simply use a balloon. Pour the homemade milk chocolate onto the balloon. Pour the homemade milk chocolate onto the balloon. Delicately pour the homemade milk chocolate onto the balloon. Perfect. Enjoy. How to make katsu curry. From making the curry mixture to preparing the Japanese chicken schnitzel, everything will be thoroughly covered in this recipe video. You'll need Japanese curry mix, jasmine rice, plain flour, eggs, carrots, potatoes, onion, panko breadcrumbs, vegetable oil, and a whole chicken. Start by peeling and chopping two carrots. Then peel and chop four potatoes. And finally, dice one onion. Place a large pot over medium meat vegetable oil. Add the onions. Saute onion pieces until they start to turn translucent. Add the carrot. Add potato. Stir thoroughly. Add water. While that's simmering, it's time to prepare the chicken. Using a knife, carefully remove. Perfect.